Hello, today let me share why we are required to be switch off the Lu8 and Lu8 if it was fought in our order to get the engine fire on Owani could invest. There is the question. I'm already post post the engine fire on one engine fire on deletion system. So before we go to simulation, let's let's go to the engine fire on deletion and fire system. Here this is the ADS 72 fire the centered fire on uh, fire extinguishing system. Fire border one, fire border two, and this is the engine fire detection loop. It has two loop, loop A and loop B. Each loop have the five sensory element. This is the fire detection control unit. When our <coughs> fire sensor sends the fire signal, this for the way engine to fire like this. Here, our fire detection sensor send the signal to the fire detection control unit. Then we can see the engine to fire and uh, it is flashy. So what are we going to do? We already know put the fire hand in. We can see the squid one and squid two. So process it. The first one squid. What will happen? This agent one here. This fire put it. They just number one two fire put it. They just do the engine. After after pressure will release here. They just one in. They just do. This this is uh, kept inside. So for this kept inside, engine two is. And you, and you do fire about this is an agent too. Best, uh, we can use next engine fire bottle one here like this. You see, this bottle go up here. This fire the charge fire agent the charge to the our engine. Then pressure the charge charge reduce. So we already use the engine fire bottle one and. Fire for the two. This is the normal fire extinguishing and fire delay system. So, uh, this is the fire loot A and loot B. It has the fire sensing element. Now, this is the fire sensing element location. This is the our engine. This is the our engine about on the gully forward and rear. This is the engine exhaust jet pipe. This you can see two wire. This is the loop A and this is the loop B. So how to detect the fire? If we get the fire, our fire sensory element to this extent as the decrease, then capacity increase. In this condition, our fire condition units understand this is the fire. So this is a short circuit. So how to do the short circuit? After the resistance decrease, best capacity does not increase in this condition. This is the short circuit. In this condition, we can see the loop fault in our loop 8 or our loop B. So, in this condition, if you do not set off the our loop 8 or affected loop B, we cannot get the final warning. This one, we are doing set off the loop A or loop B. So, why it is required? Why it is required to do so? So, let's go to the simulation. You see, this is the in your fire detection segmented, very basic segmented, and not exactly because uh, I only select the required items. This is the fire detection control unit, and you want and you do here. Yeah, this is the this circuit is located our in your fire detection control unit. Zero means no fire, no fire, zero means no fire, once me fire. This is the loop for the way once. Uh, you see the one is the loop A fire. One is the loop B fire. Here you can see our um, fire detection is a flashy. Meaning that we, you can get the fire detection signal because loop A and loop B both loop are operating as uh, of uh, the way. That's why uh, we can get the fire signal. So the question is: uh, If we have problem on loop A or loop B, for example, loop A. Cannot sense the fire signal like this. Zero here. Our fire one a fire one is off because loop a cannot cannot detect the fire. So what are we going to do? 
we have to switch off the lua you see here this is the already on so we are now we have to switch off to get the fire detection signal here you see here this flashy now we can we we re, we um we give it the fire detection signal if you switch off this if you switch on you cannot give this the lua so for it's the same idea the luffy if the luffy has the problem like this we cannot get the fire detection fire detection warning so what are we going to do we had to switch off the luffy like this here we can give recap the fire warning signal if you switch if you switch on you cannot you cannot fire warning signal so okay so the so business idea of the uh, segmented or electrical system is here this is the our light switch this is the power this one is the ground so every circuit needs the power in ground in order to operate this our electrical system so let, uh, let us show let us show this uh, for the way our light light our fire detection light this is the power ground this is the control switch here like this mm, power and ground this we, we can see the light so th that is the idea i've so here do a both do a and b are operating this ground signal you see this ground signal go this way here this the light assembly this one is the power this line is the ground so here is the ground, ground, and this is the power. That, that, that's why this is already. But if you have problem on when the loop A, like this, you cannot get the fire detection. So we have to switch off this one. What will happen here? This ground signal. You see, this ground signal go this way. Here and then, like this. This is the power. This ground, because you cannot. You cannot get this one. We, we you cannot this one. But this not already. That is why we have to set another ground signal from this sweat. That is why you are required to sweat or this one here. Here, we have no ground signal to this way from this way. Okay, this is the same idea for the loop B like this. Here we cannot get the fire signal. So what are we going to do? Here, so where is the ground? This is the power. Here, here, like this, like this. Here, we have the solid value A. This ground go this way. Here, this is the power in ground. This object. That's why we have to switch off the affected loop A or affected loop V. That's why we are required to switch off. That's why procedure, some procedure come from the our system. That's just the uh, ice where all the fire detection system. In this condition, we already saw the loop B, and if you saw the loop A, we cannot, we cannot get the fire detection system. Fire detection. <laughs> yes. Okay, that's for watching to my channel. If you like my video, please subscribe my channel. Thank you.